what is a 21st century woman? Like, what is that? Is that someone who's dependent? Is that someone who's independent? I don't know. It depends on the views and that. Not joint is bad people just fall into them. Um, so talking to the mic, idiots. <laughs> You don't think I have all this special, special production oh, from nothing? Anyway. All this, you know, innovative, <laughs> all this, all this innovative market leading, you know, for no reason. Can you talk into the mic? No, do you know, all I'm going to say is bare people follow social media and what they think a 21st century woman should be. Yeah. Right, just be yourself. So okay. what's the difference? Mm. What's the difference? What do they think it is then? What do socials tell us? It is? Whoa, 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 whoa. First, first, first. <laughs> Shola, I know you're very eager. I'm you want to tell that. them what you think? <laughs> First of all, I'm going to my right. Jakim. Oh, I knew you were going to come to me first. Yeah, because you're the first one on the table, fam. Right, let's just go back over again. So what was the question? What's the 21st century woman mean to you? Yeah. What is that? Is that is that a woman that... Uh, do you know what, actually? It's a bit. Of, it's a mix of both, like independent and people who depend on a man. I feel like it's a bit of both. Some women you get who are really independent, got their own business and they don't really... Not that they don't need a man, but they want... A, like, not want a man either, just like, there's want sometimes somebody there, but they don't depend on him. Whereas then you've got other people who expect them to pay for everything, expect them to take them everywhere and spend everything on them. Do you know what I mean? Would you, what do you think? <laughs> don't even... <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? What do I think? Let me hear from. What do I? What I wait, 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 wait! I made a mistake. I made no, a mistake. You know I made a mistake. I made a mistake. Pause, pause, pause! I made a mistake. I didn't shout out my people in the audience. With me, I got big fest, big fest, big fest. Make some noise for big fest. Nobody wants to make noise for him. <laughs> Nobody wants to shout for you. But because no, Fed is one of the baddest, uh. biggest real estate agents in Dubai. I can say that firsthand. Even though he's giving me plots that have been sold already, dickhead. I told him I want I got a buyer. He wants to buy plot. He's giving me plots that's already been sold. But that's a personal problem. Hey, right, shut up, Joe idiot. All right, I got with me. I got with me, Miss Aliyah. How are you? Well gone, Aliyah. All the way from Wolverhampton, <laughs> Bromtown. Can you make noise? Yeah. Hey. hey. Hello, hello, hello. And I go with me, Mr. Yeddy. Mr. Diet starts next week. <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying though, Kelly? You good there? Yeah? Amen. Hey, we thank God for your life. Yeah, what were you gonna say though? I heard you were trying to trying to trying to import or something. Jump the gun. Don't worry. I'm going to get to that later. Just their finances in general. I'm going to get to it later. Wait, explain that. No, 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 no. Jakeem, I just want to know what you think. What do you think? Do you think a man... What do you think? You know, you I said myself. two sides, yeah? You yeah. said there's a point where you got the women who are independent and you got the, women's, the women that are not independent and they want that. What side are you falling on? And I want the truth. Because yeah. if you're not no, telling I'm, me the truth, I'm, I'm going to get a blue cap. I'm falling on where I'm not, I'm, I'd am i never be dependent on a man, but yeah. you know, it's nice to sometimes have someone who's going to like take you out, spoil you and get you things and stuff. Like it's nice. Obviously no, I'm not, say it's not nice, yeah. but I don't depend on them. Like I, I can't, it's not like a, I can live by myself. I can live by myself. Like I've lived by myself like most of my time. So yeah. I'm used to it. Do you know what I mean? Mm. But like, it's just nice to have someone who will do that stuff for you sometimes. Do yeah. you know what I mean? And it makes yeah. you just feel good. Like why would it not? Yeah. Yeah. I hear that man. I hear that. Like, I'm with you. I'm with you. Don't worry. That was but obviously it's, it's, it goes both ways as well. Like I'm not. I'm like obviously I'm not gonna go buy my man like a bag or something. Like do you know what I mean? I'm gonna take it to the mall and go buy him a bag. The bullshit. But if we're out for food or whatever, <laughs> yeah, we'll split the dinner. Or I'll get it or whatever. You get it this time. I get it next time. I want to know what you really nothing. I'm coming back to you later. I'm coming back to you later. I'm coming back to you later. I feel like you know. I'm coming back to you later. I'm coming back to you later. I want to know. We got Kara Becker in the house. She got her own business. She's doing cooking. She's cooking for everybody and all of that stuff and doing mass catering. I want to know what you what 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 side you're falling on. Are you falling on the side where you want a man to take care of you, or are you falling on the side where you think I don't need no man and I can do my thing myself? All right. So I'll answer your question in terms of what I think it is first, because that's a whole other discussion. But I agree with what Shola is saying in terms of social media. I think in the modern day we're being like forced to almost forced to because it's everywhere like to conform to society and the trends that women are taking however for myself because you asked what it means for you right really, really, for, for me you. so for myself like i think it's hard because of the impacts of social media but i think it's all about 
taking the lessons that have been taught and instilled in us when we've been growing up from our parents who have worked so hard to shape us yeah, definitely. and actually making something of it. There's nothing worse than spending your time to raise your child to be a certain way, to break away from what's happened in the past and then you do nothing with it. So for me, that's what it is. Oh, and that's my attempt to do it. It's not to say that I am doing it. Um, you asked about whether... I haven't answered any of my fucking questions. <laughs> no, I thought that was a good point. Yeah, it was, a, it, was a, it was a solid I point, that was a point solid on that, but I, I found myself a bit confused. <laughs> not come. How should I break this down for you? Because you know the modern woman's like yeah, vocabulary me. doesn't quite fit yours. So. Oh! <laughs> what do you want? What do you want? Whoa, which one do I press? What do you want from me? Listen, I want to know if you are the type to say, I want a boyfriend who's, or husband who's going to look after me fully, pay the bills, mm. pay for everything, mm. and I just enjoy. <laughs> I want to know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The thing I think is, my face says it all, but I agree with Jakeem in terms nice. of it's nice to have yeah. both. However, I won't stand on one side to say I'm this independent woman that does it, da, 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 because at the end of the day, everybody wants love regardless of how successful you're going to be. So I want to know... Hold on a minute. Sorry. I want to be able to provide for myself and know that if yeah. my man happened to leave me or I left my man, mm-hmm. I'm still going to stand on my own two feet. Yeah, Correct. that's exactly what I'm trying Will to do. Will you get with a nigga that's broke? I have done in the past. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, but how long that one lasts? That one doesn't last long, does it? It lasted too long because it took a while for my maturity to become a modern woman. That's what makes you who you are. That that's what makes you who you are. You got how many exes have you been with that are broke? Let's not hot people up here. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Shola, <laughs> moving on swiftly. <laughs> swiftly. <laughs> swiftly. <laughs> I want to, I want uh, uh, what's good? What are, you are you good, yeah? yeah. What's Show here saying? <laughs> show here popping, yeah? Listed on the stocks exchange very soon. <laughs> <laughs> what are you telling me? Like, what, what are you saying about a modern woman and that? Do you know what? I'll be so real as I am. But, yeah, um, bullshit. Just be truthful. I'm being truthful. So do you know what? Before I would have like done the whole yeah, 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 Miss Independent, all of that, yeah. doing this, doing this. Mm. Now mm-hmm. I say being actually true to myself, I'm old school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I want a man to provide. Like Rebecca mm. said, I've yeah. done the whole date in the broke guy. It's dead. 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 Foolish. I, like, bro. Finish. No, don't ask me for money. Who's clapping? <laughs> <laughs> nah, trust me, same with my ex. clapping. Like, ask you for money. We got lights game for moves. Clapping. <laughs> <laughs> like broken up and you'll still owe me money. No, ah, dead. Just who? De- thank you. I, but you know what? Okay, cool. So going back to what Rebecca said as well in terms of your upbringing. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I've done the whole, not I haven't done the whole, but obviously my mum was, my parents were together. Yeah. Then my mum was a single mum. Yeah. So I've had both experiences of Trash. having a dad that's a p- full provider. So when I look for a man, yeah. that's what I'm looking for. Someone yeah. that's actually some provides for their family, that's working, that looks after the home, X, Y, Z. However, equally, I've seen my mum. Like, I've seen it's her like do the full. Yeah, yeah, I've yeah, seen yeah. her do the whole thing. So as a woman, I look. Them single like, African mums don't play for. Is it graft? Is it graft or struggle though? Because fam, what I see my mum do is struggle, fam. Mom? Like as in like to be like as a man, like when you think about what you want your wife to do, I don't want my wife to be grafting though. I know, but it's like do me you know right mean? now. My mum's working, working, working. My dad don't work. Oh, oh is it? Jesus! Living, life. living what sort of opposite, life? Opposite way around. Yeah. What sort of life is he living? Just chilling, he goes to the gym every now and then. He used to work all the time and he loves working. Like he gets bored when he's at home. At home. Mm. But it's just what it is what it is. And like he wants to go get up and get up and get a job, but it just it's, there's not no need for it right now. Like he's Well, because your mum's balling. Yeah. She we're well, not balling though. No. I want to say it, but she's But she's doing her thing. She's, she's doing, doing her, her thing. thing. But she enjoys it, it's something she loves to do. So And she she's the breadwinner. Is that what you're saying? Right now, yeah, but it used to be equal, like maybe yeah. a year ago. It's just only recently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they've obviously got they've got cashed up money savings, so they're just living. They're what, to so, uh, the thing is, yeah, you see what people always say is like they feel like if the woman's the main breadwinner, then the relationship doesn't tend to last because she starts looking at him in a certain way. He's not, not doing like that, certain though, things, my but is it parents, not like that? I need to know if it's like that or like not. Twenty-five since they were born, yeah. just, and they've been together since. My mom didn't even live in the same place. Well, your parents together. were born at twenty-five. <laughs> no, but the main thing. No, is but like <laughs> before I was born, you know, what I mean, yeah, like, yeah, my yeah, brother yeah. were born before me, and it's yeah, so obviously yeah, yeah. they've been together. No, but the main thing you said is that it's just been the last year. It's been like that. So yeah. it ain't been like that. And it's not on, it's not on purpose. It's just because we obviously came to Dubai. My mum my mom was the one who got the job here in Saudi Arabia yeah. to move. So he yeah. kind of just came with because he didn't want to be on his own in the UK. Of course not. And he just not got around to finding a job. So it's not yeah. anything like he doesn't want to work or yeah. he can't work. It's he just can. temporary, isn't it? It's just, te- yeah. And we'll probably go back soon. Like, it's not like... 
it, it's not like that. It's temporary. Know? It's not. That's yeah, not a struggle. Yeah, that yeah. don't sound like a struggle to me. I think when it's just struggle, that's when it's a problem. Mm. Have you seen Pursuit Happiness at the start? Yeah. Will Smith is Brooke trying to sell them machines. And his wife yeah. is just so frustrated because she's working double shifts at the hospital. Mm. Like, if that was the other way around and the wife was the one struggling, the man would be expected to, to, to hold everyone together. But she left him. But you know what? I think there's also like, just like there's different types of women or yeah. two types of women, the one that wants to be depend dependent or independent, it's like that with men as well. So I think in Jakeem's case, like, my dad's kind of the same. Like, he's loved work and he's grafted all yeah. his life. But... There's some men that don't mind like chilling if their woman is doing their thing. But my mum, she grafted and she succeeded and she's already retired living life. Like she's That's just the girl, isn't chilling. It? She lives yes, abroad. Like girl. her spare time, she's just traveling because she grafted. But it doesn't take away from the graft of my dad's because mm. as, as, as their children now, we've taken away lessons from each of them that is so important. Do you know what I mean? And you lot, uh, there's no kids at home anymore, isn't it? No kids at home. So everyone's Everyone, grown and moved My sister's out. got a family. My brother's living. He's got his own place. And I'm here in Dubai. And I'm the youngest. <laughs> and you're selling chicken. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> That's what you're selling ox tail. We thank God. Oh, we needed yeah, that one. We needed that. Okay, we needed that. Thank God. <laughs> no, but you know what it is, though? Like, I think, you know what it is? I feel like there's a lot of cultural differences as well when it comes to this stuff. Like, I feel like in America, they're full on the ma ma like man fully working and the woman doing nothing. This is the, Ke um, what's his name? Kevin Samuels type of stuff. He's man. a pussy, your fam. I don't rate that kid. I don't care what you Wait, say. Wait, you fam. never said what you think, though. What mm. do you think? Me? Yeah, what okay. do you think? All right, cool. Yeah. I on. think the perfect scenario is for the man to be the main breadwinner and, and the woman to still have her own fam. Yeah, it's like if you're living under the roof of someone and they're making like the most money or the, the, uh, a lot of money, even if you do something on the side, even if it's not working, but you're still just doing do something, something in your life, like you're doing a university degree or you're doing something. Just do something. At home, even if you are a house, at least you're doing something with your life. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, because I feel like two things happen. Like, I feel like men can have a resentment towards their woman. Eventually, even if they don't mean to, they might love them, but they're going to have that resentment and it will start to affect the relationship in different ways. And also, if the woman's not working and the man's just doing his thing and he sees that she's not ambitious or trying to do anything, then that also affects the relationship because he doesn't have that, that level of respect, do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Whereas with a woman, if I'm doing my thing, I'm successful, my man is even like more successful or on that level, that motivates me and we get each other, you know? You know what? I can't ignore the fact that a woman requires a man who's more financially stable than a man requires a woman who's 100%. financially stable. I can't ignore that because the thing, the whole point of being a modern woman is it sh we should be at the point now where it actually doesn't matter. We should be at that point. Yeah. We should be, but we're not, we're not at that point. We, we should be at that point, but, but we're, we're not. I, I feel like, I don't want to generalize that or like, you know, push it all and stereotype, right. but I feel like we should be, but a lot of the time the hindrance, just to translate for you, like the problem, the thing that Don't blame the men. Way, <laughs> don't blame men. I, I swear don't down. Don't blame men. Because... We can like we can we can like say oh I can't open the jar just to make the guy feel more masculine like that's a really general example but we can bring it down and not be wow. s have a big so ego. Like Wait, what's your point? <laughs> but like the guys yeah. are the ones that really will have an issue with it. So no matter how much you're not trying to stand in your excellence in front of them, they're that's still cap. gonna no. no I no, think no, that. that's, that's what cap. that's what Maybe I've experienced. You don't start acting up. Do you know what? You in the early stages, no. In the early stages, I've had guys be no. like, "Yeah, I love what you're doing. Do your thing." Da, da, da. Yeah, and yeah. as I'm continually doing that, and they might not be progressing the way that they plan to do in their life, it starts to like backhand back onto me, are and I want to stop me? excelling because I don't want him to Rebecca, stop loving me. Are you That's telling me? Right are you telling me you don't start treating him different, or even talking to him different, or even looking at him different? I feel like it's hardwired in a woman's brain. I if this guy is not getting it, then how can I even batter an eyelid at Me, it? personally, no. Because if I'm in love with you and I'm with you for the reasons I'm with you, not for your success, for your money, like if I've entered into that, knowing who you are from the outset, I'm still looking at you with the same eyes for so those you're saying, reasons. You're saying the way it is is because of men. I'm not saying, that's why I said I don't want to generalise. You said have to generalise. It's a podcast, you have to generalise. But at the same time, I have seen it happen 
a lot. I've seen marriages break down. I've seen families fall apart for those reasons. I've seen it. Because the man's broke and the man's now not feeling a type of way because broke. he's broke. He could just Look. not be accomplishing the you know goals what? he wants Go to accomplish. To touch, on, no, to touch on what you said, that I think it's both parties though. I feel like men, yeah, has a major part to play, but I feel like also as a woman, bro, to watch your man like just not do anything is dead. Yeah. Like... <laughs> feed, like, no, but you can feed his ego as much as possible. You can't lie. Like, as, but as a woman, it's like, Stop like, lying. I'm going, I'm coming home. My man's Why are you lying? Speaking. I'm coming home. My man's yeah. just doing it, nothing. Yeah. Like, it becomes disheartening. Like, no, oh, okay, cool. Stuff, but no, 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 no. no, no, no. Those are the very, very easy examples. Let's say your man's got a job and he's just not making as much as you. Yeah. What are you saying? Mm. Say, no, no, no. Let me finish. Let me lie. <laughs> Say your man was making 40 bags, pounds a year mm-hmm. and you're making 100. Mm. How are you feeling? He's going to work every day. He's doing his job. What he's supposed to be doing. The job that he's got. He's doing it. He's just making less than you. What's How are you feeling? What's his, length, like, what's his long-term goals? What does that mean, fam? He's in a job. He's <laughs> no. in a job. He's having a job. <laughs> no, but no. No, he's got a job, honest, fam. To be honest, that type of pay gap, he's clearly in an he's industry job, where fam. it's not really going to reach your level. If you're on 100 not grand, he's probably a little no, bit older than you. All right, listen. I'll, 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 put it, I'll put it into perspective. I'll put it into perspective. <laughs> if he has mad yeah. goals. Say, 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 like, say like he's doing a normal nine to five job. He's working as an insurance broker or something. He's getting 40 bags. And you... You're doing your thing, but you've been promoted three, four times already, and now you're 100 bags. How are you feeling? You're on 60 bags more than this brother. How are you feeling? Because he's not a bum. He's not just not going to work. He is going to work. He's just not on your level. He's just not on your level. How are you feeling? Tell me. So what, am I funding our whole lifestyle? No, No, you're not. Do you know what? No, you're not funding your whole lifestyle, but you you have more money. Hold on. I'll give you the type of scenario that situation could cause, yeah? It could be a thing where you really want to go to Burj Al Arab on the weekend, yeah? (laughs) But you know that one's going to cost a bag, like, each Mm. or something, like, Mm. just for a pool day, what, what, what. This is not in his budget, but it's in your budget. Simple as that. Yeah. So for you to say, babe, <laughs> <laughs> and do your hair thing, take me to Virgin Island this weekend, and he's sweating, because you would be if that's not in your budget, because he's thinking, right, I need to put down two bags for that, but for you, that's light. Yeah, but I, wow. think you, yeah, I think you qualify your spouse, and I'm not going to say your father, before that, you know you're going to get into it with someone that's, that's not their budget. Yeah, that's true. No, you know what? Their budget might be a group. Okay. No, but you, don't you know, know that. I'll tell you why you don't know that. You don't know I'll tell you why you don't know that. You, the reason you don't know that is because she could have started on 20 bags. Yeah, that's true. And he was on 30 bags. Mm. And he's improved to 40 bags, but she's improved to 100 bags. Yeah. How are you feeling? How are you feeling? Tell me how you would handle that situation. Well, and a lot of the time, in the early stages, when you don't know each other that well, there's a front that the guy might put on, off, yeah. like to, uh, yeah, and then no, when, you, do you know what I mean? And then, and then he's facts. next with you at the end of the month and you don't know why. You just see him at the bank trying to take out a loan and that. <laughs> but do you know what? I've experienced I that. No, no, I know. <laughs> I've experienced that though. Like I like to meet, you know, I'm a foodie, innit? I like to go out and eat and that's where most of my money ends up going to. I've experienced that, but then I've picked up on cues as well. Where on the odd time, like he might be cool with it, but if I'm not considering that situation without having to make him spell it out to me, that look, I can't keep affording that lifestyle, then that's me doing something wrong because I'm not picking up on them cues. I wouldn't say that, no. I will say that straight up. Set up question. (laughs) Hey, Aaliyah, Aaliyah, I want to know what you think. Hey, what do you think? Uh, what do yeah, you think a modern that scenario? Modern yeah. woman should be like. What 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 are you looking for in a man? Are you looking for a guy that can take care of you fully, yeah. or are you looking for a man that? All right. So yeah. if you can't hear her, Leah no. said. Whatever man she gets with has to bring something nah, to her life I don't think that's that she enough. can't bring to herself. That's not enough. Yeah. That's not bad. No, because no, no. it just fills in what it what fills if, in that void that you don't already have, if you, especially if you're an independent what if, woman. What if he just brings religion? Oh my god! And he ain't got. Like. Aaliyah wants money because that's know. value. No, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Aaliyah wants guys because he can bring spirituality. These are these are things that people would value, but you. Ali, I don't give a fucking damn. Do you know what? Okay, cool. You mean private chartered planes and that? That's what you mean, right? Yeah, private chartered planes. No, 
Yeah, it's not always materialistic. I feel like the only way I'd compromise. All right, cool. So hey, let me, let me, Aliyah. All right, cool. You've moved to Dubai yeah, and you're on a decent salary. You went for a, de- you work for a decent company. Decent enough, yeah? You're doing your thing. In the next five years, you're going to move up and you're going to do stuff for yourself, yeah? Would you date a man who earns less than you? Aaliyah would not date a man that earns less than her. Oh, Jesus. No, no, but That's I hear fair. it. I hear it. It's realistic. That's wrong. Higher. Nah. It's not always at a certain oh, level. Go, go. I can't lie. I, no, what, what he said is 100% right. Yeah. As well, depends on the type of man you go for. One of the mm. reasons why I wouldn't date a man that, that earns less than me is because I like an alpha male. An alpha male yeah. is not mm. going to date. Don't, don't roll your eyes. Don't roll your eyes because I saw that. <laughs> nah, do you know what? I'll, I'll, explain, I'll explain what I want to say about the alpha male thing. I'll no, explain it. Why wouldn't an alpha male earn less than you? What? Yeah, exactly. That's so true. Male, That's true. No, you, you know what? Him. Tell me why well, alpha male would not earn less. Yeah, it's because true. for me, my idea of an alpha male is someone that is a protect- protector that provides for his family. How so the in fuck does that got to do with earning less than so you? So my man is meant to. So I'm meant to earn more than him. That means you're capping yourself. You know that. What? How? Because no, she just won't go for the guy. No, just less. Less. no because in my eyes, I won't be his type. Do you get why? Why not? Why would you not be his type? You can earn a hundred bags a year. Even 200 bags a year. Nah, to be fair, have you ever heard of Rent a Dread? You heard about the Rent a Dread that likes to go for the. You know about Rent a Dread? That goes for the women that are just bringing it in. They could just live their lavish life. Some men are trash like that. Nah, do you know what? ZZ Mills said to Sideman, you know Sideman? Did you see on Instagram? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they were talking, and then she was actually like. I don't think you're an alpha male. And he was like, how am I not an alpha male? No, I agree that's, my, that's my vote. Hey, he yeah. was like, how am I not an alpha male? And his point was- straight what he was saying? On. Say it, it's your accent. She's from Sheffield, bro. What are you talking about? Same thing, same thing. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but listen. Um, yeah, he was basically saying the same thing. How am I not an alpha male? I provide for everyone. You've been to my thing. You've seen my thing. I'm the leader and all this shit, yeah? And I was thinking, bro, I don't think you're an alpha male either just because he waffles so much and he talks. And it's like, you're a chick, bro, the way you're talking. Do you get what I'm saying? Bro, I think there's more to being an alpha for male oh, yeah. than your paycheck. Yeah, yeah, yeah because so, so, what I'm saying the type of man that I like is not going to go for a Trust a me, I could earn less than my girl and give her oh. a dirty slap. A, I hear that. I hear that. Not to say that. they have to have a mad ego, but it's like he carries himself like a boss. Do you know what I mean? So he wouldn't even want to be with a girl that earns more than him. No, because you're carrying Bro, yourself like you're the head let me of tell the you household. Something. But he, let okay. me tell you something. Let me tell you something. No, 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 no. Okay, cool. Let me tell you something. Imagine, yeah, if you're earning double what your girl's earning right now and you're with her and you've been with her for years and you're still earning double what she's on. Mm. But she's on a good salary. Mm. She makes a lot of money. She makes more money than man them. Okay. But you're still earning more than her and she blows. Now she earns more than you. Mm. What are you going to do? Yeah, but that's circumstance. Like, yeah, an that's alpha male wouldn't leave his wife because. Why would you leave your wife? Because you're still yeah, the boss a, of the house. I'm talking about going into a relationship. That, that's that's circumstance. You yeah, can't that's say that. Okay, that's cool. A, that's good. Yeah, let me put let me put it into. Yeah, let me put to you again. All right, cool. I mean, I'm getting into a relationship with a girl who earns a lot of money. Mm. Now I'm a little bit down right now, but I know me. Why the man then have that? You can't predict the future. That's you can't valid. Predict that is very valid. valid. That's valid. You can't but predict I know, the future. Let me tell you that's something. Valid. You don't but know how I know it's going to go though. But I know that's me. Valid. And I know I have a serious ability yeah. to make money. I'm that's just valid. down at the moment. I can't lie to you. One thing I learned in 2019, yeah, stop falling for people's potential. Yeah. If you don't have it today, yeah, you don't have it tomorrow. That's fucking terrible. Do you know why that's terrible? Let me tell you why that's terrible. Do you know why that's terrible? Let me tell you why that's terrible. Let me tell you why that's terrible. Nah, let me tell you why that's terrible. Bro, let me tell you why that's no, terrible. You can't keep going for a man. Let me don't tell you why that that's terrible. Nah, see, see, let me see, tell see, you. Let me. Soon, let me see, tell you why that's terrible. Let me tell you why that's terrible. 2019 Timmy and 2021 Timmy Bro. are on completely different levels. Different <laughs> levels in, ter- in terms of the cash that's coming in. Yeah. But, yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. No, but it what? It what? Timmy, yeah. Though, Timmy, no. let me ask you a question. But for the 2019 Timmy, yeah. what did, yeah, you're earning money now, but were you as mature or did you learn as much then 
as a person that you you're are not the now? Same person, have you not improved in terms of how you treat, how you might treat your woman, or like, have you changed your ways of how you view a relationship? Inshallah, I'll tell you the truth. No, I haven't. The devil is a liar to me. I'll tell you I what happened. Let me tell you what happened. Let me tell you what happened. Let me tell you what happened. I've known you for a long time. Let me tell you what happened. No, no, no. Let me tell you what happened. No, no. I've known you for a long time. Let me tell you. You've changed. No, I haven't. You're not the same person you were in 2019. There's You're no crazy. chance. You are the same it don't work like that. And you know what? You're crazy. You know what? Forget that. Let me tell you. Let me. Let me tell you why I haven't changed. The core me has not changed. The only thing that's changed is circumstances and opportunities. That's it. Your attitude. Bro, your attitude, in terms of your the way attitude. You move, the things you do, these oh. things have changed. Your discipline. Huh? These things have changed. Bro. No, it's not about you haven't learned nothing. Bro. It's not about that. It's, let me tell you something. The, the equal of opportunities is the same, but the equal of outcomes is totally different. Do you know what I mean? So you might have certain opportunities that you probably had then you didn't take it. That doesn't mean you're a bad person. And that doesn't mean you're a shit person either. But so, certain things can just fall in line. Do you know what I mean? What you say? What you say? You know what I mean? As a man. No, I have not. There's nothing that I do differently that I wouldn't have done back then. There's nothing, bro. It's just, bro, it's just, it's just time period. It's just time period and opportunities. Things that are exposed to me. Things that I can see. Things that I can do. I've always had the ability. It's, you know what? I can tell you. No I can tell you three that, things that have changed about you. Tell me. I'll tell you three things: your attitude, your discipline, your confidence. Yeah, but you don't know that. Yeah, I do know that. I've known you for oh, a long bro, time. You've bro. known me for a long bro, time. You can't on. tell me that no, I've never bro. been confident. Timmy, do you I've remember? Always do you been remember, confident. Do you remember our attitude? The way our attitude was. What was our attitude, fam? Do you remember when we were in uni? What our attitude was? What was our attitude? It was shit. It was a poor attitude. No, our it wasn't a poor attitude. It's like a short-lived attitude. No, it wasn't. Stupid mistakes, bro. When we first okay. How much? How much tickets did you have your first year in Dubai? How many what <laughs> tickets? What car tickets? Yeah. How much speeding tickets did you get? Bro, in your let me first tell you how peak it is. Let me tell you how peak it is. Go on. I will have the same fucking tickets right now, but guess what? I'm gonna pay for them. No, because you won't yes. get the same amount of tickets. Yeah, I probably will. If I get a, if I get a faster car, I get the same amount of tickets I and do, pay for I, them. I don't think you would. Dude, I'm just bro. It's it's got nothing. It's got bro. It's got nothing. Bro, how can you me. tell me about me? How the hell can you tell me about I don't think that. It don't give and a you fuck. Know why? What you, you can know why? see. Because what you're saying, what you're saying, G, it's not just about you. It's about me as well. Yeah. Because I'm the same. Yeah, so? I was a very different person in 2019. Bro, bro. the only, reason, tell you the only now, reason you're different, the only reason you're different is because now you can see certain things and certain results have come apart. Nah. Some certain results have blown. When you were in 2019, you were just starting your business, bro. Mm -hmm. Now you've seen that, oh my God, there's results here. So if I do the same things I was doing, I can get mad results. Okay, and do you know what those things revolve around? What? They don't revolve around making decisions. They revolve around discipline. They revolve around bro, learning I ain't any and they more revolve. Discipline yeah, that's than what I was before. That's what I, I genuinely think you are I a different like person. I feel like I'm a different person. Oh, and wait, I genuinely wait, wait, feel. Guys, guys, guys. You know but one grow, thing man. that you're you're forgetting is in like everyone reaches their success. So you're better now in your career or your career path than you were back then. But you you made mistakes along the way. You you had things you know that you is? might not have deserved happen. Those are the things that yeah, you've but learned it what, from. It what, how you Rebecca. handled that and I overcame hear that. it. I hear that, but it that what, changes Rebecca. you as a yeah, person. Yeah, but it what? Do you know what it is? It's not even, two, hold on, hold on. Three days ago, Go I on. made a mad mistake. I lost two bags on trading. Today, I made it back. Yeah, okay. But that's got nothing to do with me being different. It's just got to do with you. You can still make mistakes, fam. It's just you as a person, you're going into certain things. You've got more opportunities. You've got more avenue to learn. It doesn't yeah, mean- do No, nah, no. Nah. It doesn't, lie. bro, it means nah. nothing. If do you, you know what? Let me tell you something. If you think, if you think you're learning, you can think whatever the fuck you want, bro. I saw trade you made. Yeah. I could, I could, listen, listen to me, listen to me. I could make the same trade I made two, three days ago and it banged for the reasons that I thought it was going to bang. That's my point. Yeah, but you're talking about, hold on, hold on, hold on, please, 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 please. Hold on, hold on. I feel like, I feel like we can't talk about trading. I don't think that's relevant at all. Yeah. And I don't, to be honest, to be honest, to be honest, yeah. It was, it was. I don't even think, I don't even think money is really that relevant to this because what we're talking about, what we're talking about, completely off the subject Hold on, Completely. What we're talking about is, relationship and how well suited you are to a partner now compared to where you were two years ago. And I think that's a lot less about money and a lot a lot more about your how personal- How they treat you as well. About your self-awareness, bro, about your self-awareness. And there's no way, and there's no way you can tell me that things like 
um, personal growth and self-awareness come with money. They don't. They, they come do. with experience, bro. Mm. They come with growth and they come and, with and, and, they and, come and, with other and, stuff. They and, come and, with relationships. And, and, they come with that type of stuff. It first no. it comes with money, number one. I don't think so. And it comes with a partner. It comes with who you're with, fam. It comes with who you're with. If you're with a foolishness, you are going to be foolish. Let, let's get a question because I'm, I'm losing with, track of what we're talking about. I'm losing track about what we're talking about right now. Hey, Jakeem's lost. I'm lost, man. There's things going on. Hold no, on, no. go on, hon. All right, go on. Go on, hon. Let's actually like, retract. Yeah. No, no, no. I want to retract back to the fact that if you, like, as a woman, you said that the woman didn't come on the world title. Show luck. They all did. Don't call my name. Family was like, show luck. <laughs> Go on. Yeah. Uh, Martin, baby. Do you, know, man, no, do you know what, yeah? I was going to ask on the basis of that, do you not believe that Dubai gives women that earn probably averagely, like the same that someone in the UK would earn, do you think it puts women on a pedestal because they've seen probably, okay, certain men, all right, let's be real, Dubai is a facade, you know, certain men may look like they're earning money, but they ain't really earning money. So Trust if you get a girl, a girl thinks they're in a stable job, they think they're doing good. Like, to me, I don't think that's good, is it? Because I've seen the real women earn real money, but do you think the why? Because women that have just okay jobs on a pedestal could think that they're better than, that they should get a lawyer because that's on 100 bags, or should yeah, get a yeah, bank yeah. car or equity trader that's on yeah. 100, 200 shares in a month. Do you think that the why does that to women? I think it, it definitely has played a part in no, a lot of the women. I'm not going to lie, I meet women that are on 10 or 15k. I'm not going to lie, even 20k at my age as a woman, yeah. I look at you, I think. Mm. Like you're not mm. doing anything crazy. Like it's not yeah. yeah, but, uh, but that's age? okay so by Dubai standards, though. The standards yeah, of Dubai are different. Yeah, but twenty k, twenty k at this stage. But the forty, no, but the forties and fifties, the forties and fifty k's. I know someone that was on like fifty five k that was smashing it, and she got treated in a way that she certainly exactly. didn't deserve. That's what I mean, but then you meet, yeah, like on like eight or seven k, and they're like, well, they're good. or even fifteen k, they still. Do you know what it is? And I just that's think, though, but they might be though, thinking about their home, own personal bad. growth. Yeah, but... That's not bad, but yeah, by but the don't forget, I hear it. Yeah. Don't so maybe they're on that, maybe they're on that, not because they're looking at their man and what they're earning, but maybe they're just like, that's a massive achievement for me. And they're probably thinking about themselves yeah, but in terms of how they express No, let's that. not forget. Do you think girls put themselves on a pedestal when they earn that? Do you know... I don't not all not all some do some do with Dubai I don't even think it's even a money thing you know you need to bear in mind it's actually Dubai so a lot of it comes down to man so man can earn big 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 money but if you're just a girl you can be broke yeah. and man is still going to chat yeah, you out true. here do you get what I mean so it isn't mm. even about the money it don't even make yeah. a difference <laughs> I, it does matter you know what yeah 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 yeah. but listen though listen though land land in my airport on my wrong way, mm-hmm. bastard. Do as much, yeah, whereas a man has to do a lot. Mm. Because if you're earning more, you're more, more time to do more. Yeah, but I'm not going to lie to you. I would never get with a girl that's not on a fucking amazing salary. Mm. I wouldn't do that. Same. I wouldn't have a girl as my girlfriend Same. who wasn't making serious bread. That's fair enough. I would. That's I wouldn't. I would. I, I really would. I really would. How is that a lie? Look at my track record. Look at my track record. Look at my Look at my history. But that's but no, but that's calm to you though. Look at my history. Like, but some but some man just want a trophy wife. I'm not onto that. Yeah. Some I need someone who's solid. No, 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 no. Hold on. Yes. You'll be fine with Yes, I'll be fine with that. Let me tell you. What's wrong with that? Let me tell you. 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 Let and do you yeah. know what? I, 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 was gonna, I, yeah, I agree with that. I think, look. Because let me tell you something. Yeah. During quarantine, how many people lost their job? Like, mm. I did. Yeah. Yeah. And do you know what? So I was going to get on to that yeah. as well. And you'll still get man. However, nah, however, do you know what? However, <laughs> it's the character that will raise them back. Absolutely. Say, yeah, I, I agree with that. that. Mm. That's why that's my brother. <laughs> To keep your job. Not necessarily. Not I lost mine. Not necessarily. I, no, but no. you know what? You know, no, no, the only no. Reason, only reason, no, no, no. No, no. no, no. no, no. But stuff, you guys are... T- that's tough to if say. you lost your job, right, if you're a pilot, then flights are still running. If you're not a top elite pilot, you've got cut the cord. 
No, no, no. no, no. no, no. no, no. no. what? Humphrey. A lot of things are different. It's different depending on what you're doing. The reason why, the reason why, the only, no, the reason why I disagree with you, I agree with you to a certain extent. Listen, listen, listen. Hey, 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 hey. I know, I know, I know. Sometimes it's lost in first. Can you shut up? Can you shut up? That was me, Shola. That was me. That was me. That happened to me. That happened to me. That happened to me. I will slap Yo. everybody here. Everybody will be slapped. Yo. Listen, everybody listen. I can't hear you. Listen. No, it's not. Right. It's but not. I, that happened to me. Let's hear what you keep saying. Listen. Listen. No, wait, 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 wait. I wasn't shit at my job. I got a thing with my benefit. What was yourself? Wait, wait. I need some order in this bitch. I'm going to tell everyone when they can talk. <laughs> Fucking hell, bruv. Otherwise, it's I can't really- It's just it? It's I just trying to make a point, innit? I can't hear nothing, bruv. Let me, I'll tell you when you can talk and you can talk. Jakeem, shut up, yeah, bastard. it's not like that at all. Obviously, I lost my job during the pandemic. What were you doing? What was your occupation? Jewelers, jewelers, jewelry. You were selling jewelry. Jewelry. I need buzz down. But- No, I was, no. <laughs> I was only there for two months. You should- <laughs> I was there for two months and then I went on to furlough. Yeah, you were the best thing. Everybody went on to furlough. Everybody, even the manager. Everybody. <laughs> what are you talking about? No, Don't but piss you know me what? Off. So it isn't like that at all. It's last in, first no, out. That's it. Because they've, they've got other people on there they need to put. But in. you know what? Listen, but first, listen, it's not that deep. Wait. Wait. Hey, listen, I don't want to hear no talking out of hand. Fucking hell, let me tell you when you can talk, fam. Talk in the mic, please. Oh. To me, can I talk, please? <laughs> no, you cannot. No. I'm going to talk anyway. Rebecca, let me hear you. Right. So, what Benley was saying is something I wanted to say, like, but from a little, slightly different angle. Everyone's talking about salaries, but like a successful person or woman or whoever is not always on a salary. Like myself, for example, I'm just out here doing a two-time entrepreneur, can I just say, can I just and. Say, sorry, Timmy, sorry, let me just interject quickly. My babes, uh, I hope she watches this. And in May, she's Come on, Jay. Yeah. So you can actually, and it's not even subjective, this is that's the most very much mm. evidence to say that you, if you are in a salary, you're probably going to be in a better position. Right. Better. So you're thinking about like stability and the people that make the decisions to become an entrepreneur or to decide to take like not be on a salary, they're taking a risk and they're also ex accepting that there's going to be failures mm -hmm. and there's going to be um, low points. Just give me a sec. Hurdles and all that. They're going to they're going to know that. And they and every millionaire and multi-billionaire, unless it's like inherited through the family, have had their moments of complete struggle where they're talking about being bankrupt, this, that, and the other. So it's not. So it's not talking about. Money hold on, now. please this let me land. So it's it's not about the salary in that respect. But it's about even if even if a, uh, an entrepreneur or a business owner fails in their first year, don't watch that failure. Watch what they take with that failure, the lessons that they take from it, and how they flip it around. Some people give up. Yep. Some people take that and then use that as motivation to keep going. Like they're not gonna. A lot of people come to Dubai and they're still here, like five, six years later than they plan to be because they haven't accomplished that goal mm. that they set out to achieve. So they're gonna keep going until they at I least hit that. The case. I think some people are just trapped in the life. But in the same breath, like people say, never give up. Never give up because you can do blah blah. At the end of the day, some people are actually genuinely miserable. Don't trust. Like mm. you know, Jesus. Okay. Yes. Business acumen masterclass. Yeah. <laughs> All right, listen, listen. Let me tell you what I think. On that situation, on that situation, you see what I said? Oh, he's airing him. Wow. Oh, uh, you see on that situation where I said that I won't be with a girl who doesn't do a, like who doesn't make money for herself and that. I will extend that to say if a girl's doing her own thing and she's trying to do her own thing. That's absolutely fine. So Why? Because the mentality is there. No, I don't yeah. give a fuck, fam. Yeah. So it like, depends. So for example, it de wait. It depends. It depends. It depends. It absolutely depends. If she's doing a business where, like, I feel like mm, this business might not work, I will be real with the girl that I'm with and say, "Baby, excuse me, this is not <laughs> really working." But if it's something that I feel like it can blow and it mm. doesn't blow, and she gave it all, I'm happy with that. I'm happy with the mentality. I'm happy with the effort. I'm happy with the energy that she put into it. That's okay. So, so, anyone, so you wouldn't, 
Anyone so, can hold pray. On, hold on. So you wouldn't date a girl. Hold on. So you wouldn't date a girl who has a normal job because you said that you'd only date a girl who earns significantly more than other girls. Yeah, I would. So that's what you said, right? It's you'd only date a girl that earns significantly it's more not. than than other girls, right? No, not necessarily than other girls. If a girl's bringing in three Gs, four Gs, pounds a month, I'm more than okay. Yeah, so you want a girl that earns well, I, but no, no, you don't I'm, mind I'm, a girl You know what who, it is? Yeah, I'm okay with a girl that is on top of her game, if it's a nine to five thing, but I'm also on with a girl who's doing her best to make it to the next level. So you I'm don't okay mind a girl that. who's an entrepreneur but makes no money. Yes. But you do mind a girl who works at the cinema and doesn't make much money. Absolutely, because she's taking a piss, fam. It's the ambition. She's, she says she's, she's a prick. All right, she's I'll tell you. I'll tell prick. you why I disagree. Tell I, me. I disagree with that because when I look for a woman. I think finances is the last thing on my mind, to be honest. I mean, I don't. yeah, I mean, if you I agree with that, let's stop talking about money right now. Yeah, yeah. I think, yeah. to be honest, Not yeah, probably. I think when it comes to a relationship, I'm a man and I'm gonna have to stay with this girl for a long time and I can't cheat, which means I'm gonna have to be very serious <laughs> about can, this woman. You know, she, she, <laughs> listen, let me finish. She's gonna have to have so much more to her that has nothing to do with right. money, yeah, but then, for me to be happy for the rest back, of my life. Take it back. And this is why I go back to the whole Apple though. Right? Wait, one question. Go on. Go on. Ask me. Well, go on. That's why I was, he doesn't. It's, not it's all about the money. Two, like, it's not listen, all about money. Let me tell you, let me tell him. Let me answer his question. Oh, no, no, hey, hold on. Timish, let me answer his question. The two um, relationships I've had that have been <laughs> my longest, which is two years, yeah? I've not, I've not considered, shut up. I've not considered their earning potential at all. And to be honest, my first one worked in boots. I was in uni, I stayed with her for two years. My second one, my second one used to work in a job, not a job center, but she was, um, she was just a receptionist. What, what, I didn't care about the money. Yeah, but we oh, were 16. It didn't matter. Was really no, no, I wasn't 16. Yeah, I was, what, like, what, if, what if, what if, what if. Take it back to the original like, What if you was with somebody but, and they were making the good money, they were making the money that you wanted them to make or whatever, but, um, Look, <laughs> look, my point is, no, wait, my point is I've met a lot of women. I've met a lot of women. <laughs> I've met a lot of women that earn well. And but that Chris, is not something Chris, that I'm even but like, Chris, I don't care. Like Chris, I'm not you bothered. You were saying yourself, you were the one that was asking questions about like dating and then paying for everything. And then the girl becoming expensive and all that. So if that's the case, and then a woman is just like, eating out your money, of course it's going to affect you. No, so because, then you're gonna end up no, 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 no. Because what a man should do, a man should know his peas, isn't it? And he should know what his girl is on too. Okay, cool. This is our budget then. We meet in the middle. I'm not going to start take doing the most. And if, it if don't I'm happen, the only one spending, you're gonna leave I'm just going to budget. I'm not going to leave. I'm not going to leave. Not necessarily. I'm not going to leave. It's how you get on with each other as well. It's but personality. I'm not going to leave because when it comes to a relationship, yeah, it's n it's not, there's nothing to do with materialism and flexing. Right? We don't need to no, go to there No, but sometimes there. it's about survival. I feel like, I feel like you know what? Listen, I feel like that's the stuff. I feel like Let's not talk over each other, please. Let's not talk over each other, please. Let's not talk over each other please let's let uh, someone finish their point before going yeah so what i'm trying to say is that when it comes to a relationship situation yeah it's not about flexing slap you. It's, it's, yeah yeah but yeah but your point is that oh she's going to be drinking my peas no, that's not my point What's that's not point? what you're saying still Go on. That's, that's not what i'm saying i'm not saying that she's going to want to be spoiled the whole time and blah blah yeah, but i me. have experienced it on the <laughs> other side and i know a lot of guys have experienced it you guys are now a team you're one my money is your money and vice versa when it comes to when it comes to when it comes to hold on hold on when it comes to when it comes to like survival and the living of the day to day no, wait, hold I on. I beg you, let me land. What, 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 what I'm not trying to say yeah, like, oh, man. I'm just going to sit back and I'm just going to take your money and go shopping and blah, blah. But if if your woman is not earning enough to, let's say, um, you cover the rent and then she covers the car and something. If she's not able to do that, so therefore you're taking on the bigger expenses. What be. can she do? Oh. Not it's, it depends on the kind of man you're dating. That, no, oh no, my no, God, no. it happens a lot. No, right. Where women aren't even working for time. and All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, listen, listen, listen. I'm going to do my thing. I'm going to do my thing. I'm going to do my thing. Please, please, please. For him, I want to hear you. Then after for him, I'm coming to show Thank you. For him. Because I might actually forget my point. Culture. 
Thank you. No, nah, that's a long statement. Wait, wait, one second, one second. Shola, please. Just I, quickly. You're gonna go. To, you're gonna go to hell. I mean, Shola, please. No, nah, okay. Just quickly. Yeah. And the only reason why I say this because, like I said, I feel like I've done both. I've dated someone that earns less than me, and mm-hmm. I've dated people that earn a lot more than me. Mm-hmm. And I can't lie. The people that have earned more than me haven't actually really cared about what I do or how much I earn, which is why I changed and I said, oh, I don't really care as much when it comes to like. Why, why do you think they haven't? Wait, because, wait, wait, wait. because again it comes back to the type of man it is that like, I now go for men that are providers kind of thing so it's more about the person that I am and like my like what values I actually bring you need to understand with certain things no 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 yeah Boom. It could, do you know what? It could be, and I feel like with dating, you never actually really know. You that's don't the know. Realest. You that's don't the realest. Know. You never do. Yeah, that's you the realest. Sometimes that's you the realest. actually never know. I think that's a poor excuse. I actually think that's quite weak. No, All right, cool. but sometimes, uh, no, sometimes you don't. I'm, that I'm, is the realest. Bro, I'm going to sell that dream, you know? Uh, Fahim, tell me. No, what are yeah, you saying? Oh hey, hey, yeah. shut up, yeah. shut up, shut up. Let me finish my point. Let me finish my point though, quickly. Okay, finish it, quickly. You have two seconds. One, two, finish. Fahim, please, let me hear you. No, because I can't remember what I watched, yeah, but... um. One billionaire, millionaire, whatever it was, he was basically saying he doesn't mind his wife not working because she takes care of the home. She does everything yes. else that so she's got to do. Yeah, stuff. So yeah. no, but when you get to a certain point, when you get to a level, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm you telling you. I'm not saying that I wouldn't work. Yeah, but I'm listen, a, listen, I'm listen, listen. I've worked. I've worked. I'll, I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why that's relevant. Set. I'll tell you why that's relevant. When you get to a certain level, you're not going to get that straight away from. I'm not trying. You see, if I ever get mad rich and I don't have a girl, I'm never going to get a girl. Because I'm like, I don't know if you love me for me. What bitch. are you talking about? Oh my God. <laughs> oh, no, my God. Oh, but let me fucking finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. If I ever, ever get mad rich oh and I don't have a girl beside me already, there's no way I'm going to trust these fools, fam. I'm going to get a girl that is with me on the come up. Why? Because I know that she's ready to stand by me. So Yo, when I- You are foolish. You are, you are foolish. You are a prick. That's why. That's why. That's why. That's why. That's why. No, it's not. No, it's not. You're so dumb. No, shut up. Yeah, yeah. I listen. So what are you saying? If you're going to get bitch, you're not going to get a family. You're like, what if you want a family and settle down? Yeah, like, but kids, yeah, yeah. Wife, if you don't want bro, none of that, I'm paro. You're rich. I'm paro. That's not make sense. Yeah, it does. I'm paro. You, 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 you lot are going to get a girl. Get, when you're rich, you're going to get a girl and she's going to be with you and she's going to divorce but you. But don't tell her you're rich then. Don't tell her you're rich. How's she not going to know you're rich, fam? Well, don't tell her you're rich. And then you're going to finish, fam. even that. Yeah, it is. First time you meet someone, then you like, don't tell him that. It's because, like, say you do get rich, like you said, yeah. Because let's not forget again, there's levels to being rich. There's billionaires who look broke to other billionaires. There's such levels that you could be on a level where you're now in the circles of princesses of other countries and stuff like that. Like there's women on different levels who aren't gonna want you for your money. So regardless regardless of you're this rich, you're still nutting on her. So how can she want you for your money though? That's so stupid. Do you know what I mean? All right, listen, Fahim, what did you wanna say? I would just say, yeah. Thank you, Ben. Twin, you're done. Yeah. Mm. Because that is hard work. That is hard work. I'll tell you why. I don't. I'll tell you why we don't forget that. I'll tell you why you can't really apply that to yourself right now, because you don't know that that girl that you're with right now. Obviously, your thing. Your thing, but payment plenty. But you mean. Yeah. Can someone clap for my nigga? Yeah. He's married. Yeah. Clap for him, clap for my niggas. She knew that, yeah. She's not good. But she started her own business. Jesus. Obviously, on the flip side, both sides. Yes, sir. She was bringing in the bread. Yes, sir. Crazy bread. Bring the now bread. She's starting a business. But it's about the character. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So she holds her house down. Yes. Yeah? She holds her house down. But as a man, I'm not looking. First thing I do, last thing I do is look at her salary. You get what I'm saying? Because there's other important. Yeah. Thank you. From a man. Yeah. So someone that can look after the kids. Jeez. Like all right, cool. Yeah. Let me, let me tell they're, you. They have actually big points let me, as well. Let me, they have actually right, big cool. points as well. Like, are you going to look after the house? Are you going to look after the kids? No, 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 no. So let me tell you what I look for. When you finish, I'll tell you what I look for. There's other things a man looks for in a woman. Yeah. woman, there's other things. Because a woman looks for a provider. Yeah. And finances come into that. Mm. Right? So, yeah. no matter what anyone says, if a woman, if a man's broke, and a man's making peace, automatically a woman's more attracted to a guy who's making more peace. Yeah. Simple as. Simple. Simple. It's true. No, 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 wait, wait. I know what you're going to say. It's a 
Yeah, it's true though. That, but it's fact. A woman is gonna look for someone who can provide financially, mentally, everything. Even fucking Lee. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. Let, me <laughs> tell you, Let me tell you something. I feel like what we're discussing here is a byproduct of character, which is money. Yeah. That's the main topic <laughs> you guys are talking about. Today's topic is money. Bro, that's what you guys are speaking about. Here. I like this. <laughs> <it. laughs> <laughs> Bro, let me tell you something. I know. I'm that's what I said. Not Chris is doing. 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 Chris that will make the man that's lost it in the pandemic get it back. Mm. Right. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And I'm also going to highlight the fact that that guy that all of a sudden elevated to a 60k job and that by being, I don't know, what's his son or whatever, and he's high flyer and this and that. It can get taken away from him simply because he hasn't got the mentality to get it back. Yeah, but the problem mm. is, when you the world, that's the problem. <laughs> yeah, we live, we live in a fickle world. Yeah. Yes, out, that's my problem. Out, no, that's my problem. Out, that's my problem. My problem is, let me tell you what my problem is. My problem is a woman, my problem is a woman wants a made man. Then don't be dating if you're like- No, 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 let me tell you something. What the fuck do you think a made man wants to do with you? Why do you think a made man wants you? And that's exactly why I want nothing from these hoes. <laughs> Why would a main man want you? But that, do you know what? He's not even wrong. He's not wrong. Hold on. And, and that's hold on. What's a, what's a made man? I swear. Yeah, I was about to ask you know that. What, what, what is a made? But what is a made man? No, nah, let me. I'm let me finish. I'm about to land on this intro airport. Time in a one. <laughs> Listen. Why would a made man want you? What's a made man though? A made yeah, man. Explain, no, um, explain. We'll just keep it simple. A made man is a millionaire. Oh, you're over to it. Nah, not a millionaire. You're coming. No, no, no. No, no, no. Let me we tell don't you want why. A millionaire. Let me tell you why. You, you a Let me tell you why. No. When I say a millionaire, a million. Yeah. Let me tell you yeah. what I'm. Yeah, oh it is. God, yeah, but it, it is, is though. It's not yeah, all about money. Are you going to yes, live off money? Like, you can't. Yes, I can. It's about the money. Listen, listen. Let me tell you what a millionaire is. A millionaire is anything where. Do you know how you calculate net worth? You calculate every yeah, but no one cares. You calculate everything you own versus everything you owe. That's a millionaire. So you can buy a house for two million because you get on a mortgage. You're a millionaire, fam. You no, are. No, because you're. Alright, that's not a main no, man. Like no, that is a main man. But, yeah, but if you sold it, if you sold it, you're fine. Listen, no, what I'm you have saying. To pay back the mortgage. You don't have a million. So uh, we have a million in Jesus. It's just not right. Can is I get it? Listen, I think. Can I get it's, just, it? man. it's just not right. Hey, what listen. I think. Oh, I just, Jesus. I think. Timmy. Timmy. If you go out tonight, yeah, yeah. how many girls are going to want to be with you regardless of whether you're a millionaire or not? Because more time, they're not even going to know. They're not going to know. Exactly. Exactly. Girls, girls want to you know love. Do you know love, what as well? Like, if you show girls love and you show them attention and you consistently do that, they're going to want to be with you, you regardless of whether you're a millionaire. I agree that no, girls no, no. don't want so broke guys. Do you know what? Millionaires don't even They're going to want to be with you. Millionaires nowadays, they don't they lack a lot of things, Yeah, they don't, they, don't even, they don't even dress like the millionaires. They don't even look like the millionaires. Millionaires nowadays, they go out in the public. You won't even tell them a millionaire, but they could be a millionaire. They look like they own like nothing. Do you know what I mean? But have you not seen that? Or is it just me? They don't always you look like the millionaires. You wouldn't look at them and think there's a millionaire. Women in Dubai show attention. Women in Dubai only show attention to men with good spending habits, bad spending habits. Literally, if you can spend and buy yeah. this, buy that, and it's all on credit, we live especially Dubai. It's always it looks on credit. Like do you know what? I've never actually. Do you know what? I've never yeah, actually met anybody out here. Hold on, hold on. But um, how? I'm not gonna lie. How do you distinguish? Oh my god! Hey, <laughs> hum. Nah, but you know what? Yeah, but that's wrong. Yo, I do agree. I do agree that a lot of women, a lot of women, do you know what? A lot of women are gonna have their eyes pricked. Oh yeah, come on, shut up, my friend. You're gonna have a lot of women that will turn their heads like let's say in a club or in like a social setting where the man walks in and all these people are showing them attention and there's so much going on and they could be the deadest guy like not even nice at all but because they're seeing that image 
They're going to be like, right, I want to know that. I'm not going to give examples. Do you know what? You're right. I, do you know what? However, I can't entertain that, though. On, I can't keep, entertain no, no, that. No, no, hold on. I don't either. I cannot entertain that. Here's a question. Yeah. You go to a club, right? And then a bunch of men have got their own thing. And there's a guy at the bar. Like That's the one I'll probably end up with. No, yeah, no. He, yeah, I want to go right. to the table. Are you allowed to say? I don't ever want to hear you ask me. Do you know what? You're right. Like, hold on. I said no. I beg you, let me. You're going to the table like every other girl. Yeah, but, yeah, but sure, look, sure. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. Yeah, but no, no, no. <laughs> hold on. I beg you, wait. Yeah, but. Oh. I believe. <laughs> no. Do you know what? I have to let my drink and go. Nah, hold on. No, 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 the no. Thing, right, the thing is, right, the thing is I, with me. Go on, go on, you go. I beg you. Now, nah, hold on, Humphrey. Wait, 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 wait. Shola, you said I will still blah, blah, blah. If you lot are my brethren, yeah. yeah, then I don't really feel some type of way about being there. Everyone knows me and my red wine. Most of the time I used to be out there with people, yeah, and they're on tables. I'm there because that's where everyone is. And then I'm having to drop to the bar and come back to get my red wine. Yeah, but I did that before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. if you're not going to offer me that, yeah. I'll go buy my own red wine. So no. I love red wine. But... So, so, do you know what? Yeah, like, in a yeah, social what's your setting, type? what's your type? Because I'm not. Right, no, that's not me. My type. That's not what my I'm focusing type. on. <laughs> <laughs> you said what attracts me like that in a social setting. <laughs> I swear down no, now. Do you know what attracts me? No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Do you know what? I'm not <laughs> saying that. You move pedophiles or Nah. Because they buy red wine. Jesus. You're a pedophile type. And they bought you a red wine. You would still want to chill with it. Do you know what? If they came up to me and said, I noticed you're not drinking, like you've not had a drink like everyone else, is it? Is everything all right? Would you? Do you want me to. Did you not want to drink? And I'm like, I would rather red do you, wine. Do you know what? Yeah, I like Rioja. No, but listen, no, we, no. but when you ask about my type in a social setting, blah, blah, you lot know probably, like, especially the girls, you know, like people that I've dealt with. I end up oh, no. being with <laughs> everyone is. I actually, you think about the characteristic of that person. They're actually probably the quietest person in the group. They're probably the most humble person in the group that's not wanting to be out on show. The one that people think are weird or the one that people... I'm, I'm the one that will actually... Because I'm like, something's actually more intri- intriguing about it. Do you know what I mean? No, I don't want to go for the one that everyone's do you know what? No, 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 listen, listen, do you know what? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Rebecca, thank you. Competition with Timmy, Timmy, right. Yeah, what, what Rebecca's saying actually makes sense because if there's anything I've I've learned about women, yeah, is that you guys all like something different. All women in Dubai. Yeah. yeah. They all like something different. Women regardless, like you can get this woman, that woman. You yeah, you do get women who love money and love guys with money, but you also get women who that actually puts them off. Hey, let me tell you something about you what I've, and let women me tell are you just something different. Let me tell you something what I've noticed about girls in Dubai. Go on. You see the brothers that show them money, yeah? It's mad because broke niggas can get them too. Yeah, that's true. That's, yeah, the, worst, that's the worst See? part of it. That's fact. That's mad. That's fact. And you know what it is? I've I don't know what it is. I've seen that a lot. That's fact. Bro, it's because girls are more complicated than just money, money. Okay, yeah. yeah. Do you know the thing yeah, is, it right? matters. It matters yeah. if they're not broke. However, no, bear no. in mind, this is the buy. Like, uh, as a female, I can say that. Like, oh, you know sometimes no, the way like, it's with me, like, I, in the buy, it's not really that about homes. Yeah, but with me, like, I'm so picky. I'm the pickiest person you can ever meet. Like, and I, I, I'm so picky with guys, and I will not entertain anybody who I don't find physically attractive. But so you say, know wait, 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 no, wait, 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 wait. Finish, wait. So say if there was a table for the guys, and yeah, they're buying bottles, whatever, they've got drinks over there, and they, yeah, I could easily go join their table. They're like, oh, come, come. But if I don't find them physically attractive, I can't, I can't go over there because I just, I can't. No, 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 I can't do that. Chikim, Just for alcohol, Chikim, I can't Chikim do that. Admit. We ach- admit, hold on, hold on. Because, hold on, now. Nah. At least admit one thing, I've Chikim. done both before. No, I, no. It was, give me a scenario, what scenario? That you just said. You've got a choice, go to the bar, stand there, spend your own money, or 
That's what I was about to say. Yeah. To be yeah. fair, no, because to be fair, no, I'd, I'd go to the bar because do you know what? No, 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 I'm not clapping. I swear to God, like have it all the time, no. all the time. I don't think. I can't, no, I can't sit there. They be irritating me 24 seven, having a conversation, trying to trying to move to me, trying to, and I'm just like, all right. Like, but do you know what? Let's, this is, this brings my own us drink. back to the modern day you know woman, I mean? yeah. Hold I'd on. I just get my own. This, wait, wait. That exact point brings us back to the to the modern day woman. Humphrey, hold not on. Just, no, actually, not just not talking about like tables, but like just getting get my, getting my own drink and actually get a glass of wine, yeah, whatever. Yeah, not just. Tables. I've actually done it. I've done it. No shame. But bring it back to so that point. Let's just hold on. Let's just finish. Like where Jakeem was anyway, making was that point. Yeah. Things, the modern day woman now. Let's be real. If if everyone's vibing over there, whatever. And someone's onto me on that table, but I'm, I don't really want to be moved to and all that stuff. But I'm not gonna lie, I might want a drink or two, like if I if I did. Well, and there's a few people that that will. <laughs> However, the modern day woman, that I like to call it, will know how to handle themselves to cut that that shit. They don't. No, but like, I've been, 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 been in situations clear. loads of times. And, no, but I so have I, and I like, will make things very clear. And if it's getting yeah, to the point where it's you know really what guys are like, though, I will tell them straight, and I'll say, look, if you're gonna move like that, I don't, I, keep, I don't need mm, to be here no. for your drinks. Yo, I keep so if telling you're gonna move like that. I will go. Alone, you take your they don't leave me alone. Right, Yo, listen, they're listen. on me. All right, listen. And they won't leave All right, me. I met this guy. I saw this oh guy outside God. the fucking the hotel. The hotel part of my hotel. Came for my Snapchat, whatever. I gave him my Snapchat, innit? I didn't accept him. I don't do that. You can follow me if you want, innit? I'm not accepting. Subscribe. Anyway, anyway, long story. I saw him like the next week at a villa party, innit? Comes over. I'm outside on my own, just chilling. I want to vibe on my own, do my smush, you know what I'm doing. Comes over, sits, sits down with me and starts chatting, like talking. Oh, you didn't accept me. Da, da, da. He was like, oh, can we just be friends? Like, we can be friends, innit? I'm like, I don't need no more friends. Like, I'm just trying to. And the more I say to him, no, 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 I had to get up and leave Wait, myself. All right, like, listen, he was not okay, stopping. And okay. Morning, I hate entertaining shit. We like have that. heard. We I have told heard. you once, I told you twice, I told you three times, I'll leave. Get, cool, get, get, get the idea. Same get same the idea. Times. Amen, amen. Okay, cool. Jesus Christ, my brain is fried. I don't even get to ask all the questions that I wanted to ask about. Fuck it, no. Looks like we run out of time. We'll do another one. Jesus man, Christ. Fucking hell, fam. We would love to have you back to talk about some real shit. All right, listen, though. I just want to close with one question. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right, this is the question. If you had a man that had 100 mil cash, Would you be happy? <laughs> would you be happy for him to cheat on you? No. Never. Wait. No, no, no. Wait, wait. <laughs> lying. Lying. Hey, right, listen. Why would listen. anybody want to be cheated on? It's not a good thing. No, I haven't finished, fam. No, 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 no. He's got a hundred million cash. He's worth three hundred million assets. Don't care. But you will be taken care of for the rest of your life. Don't you care. got. Don't have, care. I, have I finished asking you a question? <laughs> no. So if he he's got a hundred million cash. 300 million in assets. He Whatever you want to do in this life is no problems. He will stay with you to the day. No. You I, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> and you, he will stay with you to the, the day you die. You'll have kids with him. All of that. All of that. Kids will raise them up. All of that. All of that. Nothing worse, isn't it? But That's disgusting. Imagine him coming home to you every night and he's had his dick somewhere else. Wait. But, but he can be... He can be he can be polygamous. Mm, that's just any girl who would allow that. Oh my god, I haven't fucking finished. But who are you up then? You're taking long in it. I'm just like, finishing my statement. <laughs> but or would you rather have the man who's on twenty grand a year? Twenty grand's fine, yeah. He's loyal to you. He will never ever step with another woman. But everything you do is on a budget. <laughs> sure not. No, no, don't come to me first. <laughs> first, first, uh, first, first, I want you to say your act so the people can know your act. Oh, we did that earlier. <coughs> it doesn't matter. I want them to do it again so that they can know. Nah, so personal at S twenty six eleven XX. Yeah. Show hair at is show hair store. Well, you got your business. You got a hair thing, innit? Yeah, that's what yeah, I'm saying. Yeah, tell them, tell them, yeah, tell yeah, them yeah, again. Tell them one more time. Bundles, yeah. we 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 free. Anything Only. you want, sign for your mom, your sister, your girlfriend, your nan. It's I got you. Christy. No problems. Thank you. <laughs> have tell a friend to tell a friend. Research. Anyway, um, do you know what? Honestly, I I, I don't know. I actually don't know the answer to that. Oh, that's, but I need no, a fucking answer, answer man. Shall so I tell you why? That counts as a yes, then. Next. No, it doesn't count as a yes. I honestly Shh. just don't know. You don't. And the only reason I don't know is because I feel like if the guy on twenty. 
The guy on 20K, he's 100% everything I want. Loyal. Loyal. No, no, no. Not 100% everything you want because nobody's got 100% no. everything you want. And that's but what I'm saying that you see this whole relationship is very 85, 15 or whatever mm. the calculation mm, is. Mm, so mm. if that guy on 20K mm. is closer to being 100%, I would rather be with him. 20K, yeah. yeah. 20,000. 20,000. You know, I say, as soon as you buy your engagement ring, there's no money for the year. I know you're not. You're going to his room share. You can't even pay for your time. Room share, room share. He lives in JVC, room share, in one of the villas that Chris runs. In one of the villas that Chris owns. He's got a room there. It's one of those tiny bedrooms that are built only for shelves. Big man thing. Wait, wait, wait. Let me just, let me just, let me just. No, I haven't asked you. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Are we both, I'm are trying we both in an open you. relationship? Relax. Are we both in an open relationship? No. <laughs> no. That's what I was about to ask you, That's what I was about to no. ask. No. So he's just no. out there. It's, wait, wait, wait. No. Let me tell you. Let me describe it again. The brother on 20K ain't going to step out on you for nothing. For nothing. But he's on 20 bucks. Yeah. That's 100,000 dirhams. <laughs> you know, I'm man makes that a month. That, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's a hundred thousand dirhams. Okay. That's te- less than less than ten bags dirhams a month. Yeah. One, as soon as rent, bills, all of that go is finished. Trust me. And the other guy. And he what? lives in a room share. And the other guy's got a hundred. He's got hundred mil in cash. Yeah. How many Birkin bag do you want? <laughs> How many Louis V are you expecting? But he cheats on me. No, but he steps out once in a while. Once he goes. He Why goes. Are you out. making that one sound less bad? And <laughs> really yeah, bad. No, 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 no. That guy's a scumbag. No, 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 no. The one with a lot of money is a scumbag. No, 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 no. Wait, wait. He's, he's a scumbag. He's a scumbag. Trash. He goes out with his boys. They go. They go drays. They burn the club down. He goes home. He enjoys something. And then he comes. I'm not laughing. He comes home and he tells you, "I love you, baby. It's so good." But his dick smells. But his dick smells of someone else's well, puss. So basically, he basically. But, but he's got solid cash. He even has a Bitcoin account for you. I Your money's think, growing, baby. As far as I'm aware, yeah, the man on 20K is still stepping out. I feel like all these niggas cheat anyway, so I won't even know. So who are you going for? <laughs> who are you going for? <laughs> Sorry. Who are you going for? Pick, so pick, who are you pick, going pick, for? Pick, pick, pick. Come back to me and do around. No, 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 man. Bro, you know the answer anyway. I honestly just don't know. I don't oh, know. Bro, I, can't I, need, tell I need the answer in five seconds. Five. Four. Please. I'm Three. going for the one on 20 bags, Two. but the one with 100 uh. hit me up. <laughs> <laughs> She's going to step out on him. Yeah, yeah. That's what's going to happen. She'll, she'll, she'll stay on my man, but she'll step out on him. She'll cheat on that nigga. That's how it works. Go on, Rebecca. Rebesco. Rebesco. <laughs> I'm going to play it your thing. This guy has a restaurant. <laughs> The restaurant's turning over a hundred million a year. <laughs> Gross profit, 80 mil. Don't call money. Gross profits. <laughs> Gross <laughs> profits. <laughs> Eight zero. <laughs> and six zeros after that. Net profit's more important. Shut up. <laughs> the, uh, the, the, the workers are Filipino. <laughs> They'll get paid 10,000 a month. No problem. <laughs> Rebecca. Or, or... Or do we have the guy who's working as an admin in a real estate company? He's on 5,000 dirhams a month. Times 12, that's 60,000 dirhams a month. In the UK, that's about that's 10. That's 13 bags. That's not even minimum. Yeah, trust that's me. Not even that's 13,000 pounds. 13,000 pounds a month versus a real world-class chef who's turning Yay. over 100 mil a year. But the chef... But the chef... But the chef, the, but the chef, the chef at his restaurant, you might see a little painting. She's like, oh, what's the recipe for that? Can I enjoy you after? And he's like, let me enjoy as well. He have Michelin star. Yes. You have, you have seven r- of them. Yes. <laughs> what are you going for? Well, first of all, I feel like you've... Oh, Jesus. I didn't ask for a story. <laughs> I didn't ask for anecdote. I didn't ask for a fucking paragraph or episode. Just answer, I just asked answer, please. for answer, which answer. one are you going to go for? I'm going to go for the real estate guy. Do you want to know why now? Let her finish. Let her finish. Let her finish. Did I actually want to hear why. All right, cool. Go on. 
first of all, you fucked up by trying to use my ideal man as the man that's got my dream that I'm trying to accomplish ahead of oh. me. Because I am a competitive person, so already if I'm trying to get to that and he's just there doing it and he's not stressed and life is good and I'm having to go through it, and it, that already is not good for me. Okay, no problem. Fine, he's a fucking stockbroker. <laughs> <laughs> He's a stockbroker. Right. He, he sells stocks and shares all day long. He gets rich niggas to put money into his stocks. That grows every day. And now he's a financial advisor. But he has a lot of cash. There's a lot of money coming inside. Back, back, back in back is not a problem. Louis V. Post is saying no issue. Even your recipe for all your restaurant is not a problem. Curry powder, chicken powder, everything is on top. Yeah. Which one are you going for? I'm still going to go for the same... Guy. Oh, oh my gosh. Yeah, Fair enough. Let me answer. No, Go don't on. just brush over it because I didn't answer the question the way you want me to answer it. The reason why is because if I'm going to be with someone and I'm trying to be in love with them for the rest of my life and all this stuff, then love is the most important thing. Love if don't pay gonna, the bills. I can't no, 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 no. Hold on a minute. Let me talk. No. Oh my gosh. No. We listen to you. Hold on a minute. Hold on. It's a pick me mentality. I'm no. To you. But no. Shola, hold on. You're the key this. thing. The key thing he said, yeah, is that he's not going to leave you for nothing, right? <laughs> Can we just... I'm just going to reiterate that. No, no, you said that... You the, will the, eventually the, leave him. The one that's on less income... No, 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 no. The rich man's not going to leave you for nothing. Yeah, I, no, but you also said that the one that's... They're both not going to leave Okay, you. So right. So the key thing for me now is, yeah, if I'm with him because I love him and all that stuff and I know he's not going to leave me, then that means I'm willing to invest my time my energy and my love to build my man up because behind every king is a strong queen I so mean, he's I gonna raise have i done do you know oh my god time after time i put my energy into these people to try and give them a little bit more and push them because why not share the tools with the th with the people you love i believe you has it worked can we have some names i'm not i'm not gonna give you names has it worked no problem no has it worked has it worked? No, it's not because they're, so, so, they're not. They're not. So hold on. <laughs> but that's what I'm saying. But he that said he said he won't leave me for it. nothing, in it. He said he won't leave me for nothing. So then I'll give you my time and my energy. Okay, we know you're capping. It's okay. Jakim, can you wake up, motherfucker? I'm up. I'm. up. Jakim, your situation, yeah. We've got a man. He's a rapper. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? Do footballer. Fuck it. Do footballer. <laughs> Fuck it. Do footballer. Okay. He's a footballer. He plays in the Premier League. In no, fact, no to be honest, I already know the answer to that. I'm not going for no footballers. Okay, fine. He's a rapper. <laughs> fine. <laughs> fine, man. You know what? You know what? He's not even a rapper. Okay. He's, Just a guy. He's a financial advisor okay. and he does his thing, innit? The money comes in on a daily basis. A lot of cash. He's a it's financial advisor. He's inside the pocket. He has a hundred mil. Hundred mil in cash. Really what that means is, if you want to go and buy this suits that you have on five times tomorrow, no problem. Any pint you want. Any any, any niggas. Any, any, any Victoria's Secret is your own. Any no problem. Pint. Even if you want the old shop, it's your own. No problem. I went and bought my bitch a very young salon. <laughs> yeah, yeah hey, do every day the what the fuck she want. Yes. Even like that. Like Even that. if you wanted to own your own franchise of Victoria's Secret in Jabaladi Free Zone. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's Go all yours. Jebelali. Whatever you want. Even your own shop in H Hotel next to Enish. So that your customers can eat jollof fries after. Okay, uh, get to the point, get to the point. Jollof fries and point. pints, what more can you want? <laughs> jollof fries, what can you jollof want? fries and off pint. What more can you need? What more can you need? Okay, he has cash. <laughs> Money is coming. I forgot in. who the guy was now. What a financial. He's just guy. up. He's just he's up. up fam. He's he has up. a lot of he's money. He's just up. He has a lot of money. And the other guy is broke. Oh, the other oh, guy. Sorry. The other guy. Guess it how he lives. One k a month. What? Durham. Why is it getting Wait, worse? Wait, I mean, just answer. Just answer. Just answer. Just answer. Eat, okay, fine, 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 fine. Realistic. Five k a month. So he's on pounds. No, no, no. Durham's. So that's sixty k a year, isn't it? How much is that? She actually said. <laughs> how much? How much is sixty dirhams in, in sixty quid in dirhams? I don't know. What? About sixty thousand. Yeah, twelve in it. About twelve fifteen. Fifteen thousand pounds a month. Actually, maybe. Well, you know, fuck it. Thirty thousand pounds a month. Yeah. But 
the guy with a thirty thousand pound a month, he won't cheat on you. He won't. No, he never would. Promise. No, 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 he never would. <laughs> Why he, are you acting he, like you don't know the scenario? He would just come. He <laughs> would just. <laughs> it's like, like so the world cheat on me. He no, he won't. He won't. The broke one won't. He would just come. He would just come home Which to one you. Which one do you pick? He will come all come home to you every day. He ain't touch nothing. Yeah. Are you sure? Are you yeah, yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. Well, obviously, then the, that guy. But there's another guy who makes a hundred mil a year. Oh no, I don't want to go that far. I don't want to. I'm, I'm, I'm happy where I am. What with 10, 20 fifteen k. Pounds. He said thirty k. Thirteen, I said. Oh. Okay, wait. Oh, I'm confused. No, he basically, basically, he has no. He doesn't have much money. You just about get by. Who doesn't have enough money? The, the one, one the one that doesn't cheat. cheat. The one that doesn't cheat. Oh, would you have a guy okay, who so has a hundred? Which one cheats? The financial advisor. Hundred mil The one guy. that's rich. The one that's hundred mil cheats. The one that's rich. Said there's three people. No, no I didn't. Babe, babe, there's two people. I the believe one that's rich, this one is crazy. The one that's rich. I don't have time for this. Hey, Jaquim, please just the answer. one. Just answer. One has money and he's not. He's gonna cheat on you. The other one hasn't and he's gonna cheat on you. Which one are you gonna oh, pick? Oh, both of them will cheat on me. No, no, the one without money will not cheat on you. Oh, without money then. Okay. Really? You know what? You know what? All right, cool, 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 cool. Aaliyah. Yeah. Well gone. No, hey Timmy, let's close this. Just thing. shush. Wh which one are you choosing? One hour and twenty. Which minutes. one are you choosing? But, but I like people who are real. No, that's a on shit answer. No, yeah, whatever. Oh, because you said it because all men cheat anyway. No, nah, the whole point you know is what? that one's not going to cheat on you at all. He's not going to cheat. Will, but you know what? No, he's I not going to cheat. I feel like you cheat. lot are underestimating how much pressure there is on a man when it comes to money and stuff like that. There will be so many other issues that arise by the man only being on 20K a year in comparison to the one that's on a lot more money. So many, like, men, not to say all men that don't earn a lot have a lot of insecurities, but bro. Have you, uh, Do you know what? I know. A lot of great men come with I'll be honest, yeah. I, like I actually believe you lot, and I'll tell you why. I've cheated on my girlfriend before, and I've seen the psychological effect that has, and that is nasty. It's not and worth I don't it. Think, it's not worth it. I don't it. think any amount of money can actually repair that when I deep it's your it. mental health. Unless, unless the woman is open to polygamy, you there's will be no very, way, there's no be way very, a woman that just shocked. wants monogamy will be able to be with a guy that's just cheating on her. I don't think it's possible. All right, cool. On that note, we've been nice on fucking one lounge. I got my people here. I got my people in the audience. I got my people in the fucking, in the fucking building. We got Jakeem. Make some noise for Jakeem, man. All right, we got fucking Rebecca, Kai Rebecca. Make some noise, man. We got show air, show lads, X2666666. Make some fucking noise for her, man. And we got my big fucking brother, on, bro. FT, fucking Fute knows in a fucking building, man. My bro for life, man. And then we got, we got, we got, we got my nigga Fez in the audience. We got Aaliyah in the audience, all the way from Wolverhampton. We got Bentley, he's a foolish idiot. We got fucking, <laughs> we got Humphrey, Mr. Yeah, D, Mr. Yeah, fam. Mr. Fucking Diet starts next week. And then we got Big Broski. So, what hell? What hell? Mr. Dot Wave. It wouldn't be possible Mr. Dot Wave producer, man. Much. It would never, ever be possible without you, man. Dot Wave Studio opening fucking soon. And we got these fucking guys here doing the camera thing, doing the piece. PlayStation thing, oh, everything it. making it possible. And then we got fucking me, man. Make some noise for me, man, please. Oh, yourself. Sorry. Yeah, sorry, come sorry, on, sorry, man. Sorry, sorry. Excuse me, why you put Benz? Buster. Oh, it's Hey, right, listen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here, man. We're signing out, man. Fucking hell. More to come from us. Yeah. Love, thank you. Goodbye. Bye.